Well, what's your name? Jesse. Jesse, what are you doing here in Chicago today? I'm actually headed towards work. If someone says they're in stitches, what does that mean? They're in trouble. Why can't you tickle yourself? Uh, mostly, uh, uh why? Because, I don't know, your senses. <laughs> I don't Go on. No, like, because you can feel yourself touching yourself. It just neutralizes the feelings, don't it? If love is blind, why is lingerie so popular? <laughs> well, um, I'm thinking love's actually not blind. <laughs> What's your name? Noah. No, you're a filmmaker here in Chicago? Yeah. What are you working on these days? Oh, all kinds of stuff. Um, top secret, though. Oh, yeah? What was the last project you did? <laughs> are you really a filmmaker here in Chicago? Yeah, man. <laughs> I, was, I had this brilliant scheme where um, cause I was just trying to, trying to make a living just to live in Florence. And I, I would take tourists around with my video camera and uh, make a video for the, about their vacation so they could remember their uh, time there in Florence. And you're the host? S still the host, yeah. <laughs> Right now until you've been replaced? <laughs> yeah. I might be being replaced, but uh, I, I don't know about that yet. Who came up with the idea? Uh, I did. It's my show. Oh. Why can't you tickle yourself? I can. <laughs> this part's going right. to be edited out, right? Yeah. <laughs> See ya. <All> right. <laughs> Are you going to like sign me now to be your sidekick or something? or? What's your names? I'm Sarah. Meredith. Welcome. You're from Chicago? I am, yeah. Are. And you as well? St. Louis. All right, what, what would you do if you knew you would not fail? If I knew I would not fail? Oh, I have one. <laughs> okay, what? <laughs> um, I would go live in Australia, in Sydney. Why Sydney? It's beautiful, it's very clean, and the people are awesome. It's just like St. Louis. Oh, yeah, <laughs> very similar, let me tell you. <laughs> are you more of a hugger or a kisser? A hugger. Why? I don't know, it's less awkward, I guess. Kissing can be awkward. <laughs> I'm a kisser. <laughs> I am, I'm a kisser. Yeah, it can be a little awkward if you don't know the person, right? Yeah. Once you know them, it's not that awkward? Once you know them, maybe not that awkward. Yeah. I thought we were talking about people, you know, we care about. Oh. Oh. Uh, okay, strangers, yeah, hugging. Yeah. Okay, all right. <laughs> Bun in the oven, what does that mean? You're pregnant. Or you're cooking. If love is blind, then why is lingerie so popular? Because guys are... Guys are jerks. <laughs> um, you guys have boyfriends? Nope. <laughs> She's free as bird now. Um, kind of. What are we doing today? Um, we're going to the American Girl Dolls show. Which one's your favorite? My dog now. <laughs> And is it's your birthday? Yeah. Really? How old are you? Six. She's actually turning seven. <laughs> where, where do you live? Ohio. What direction is Ohio from here? We don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, really? Is it far, though? Is there anything else you want to do today besides go to American Girl Store? Is that the most important thing? <laughs> go to the pool. Oh, yeah, because you're good swimmers? Yeah. We can both open our eyes underwater. What, what are you doing today? Well, actually, I'm just taking a break from work. I work in a retail store right up, up the street. Just came out to enjoy a little bit of the weather. Okay, having a cigarette out here in front of... Uh... Well, you know, <laughs> in front of Ann Taylor's, but I actually work down the street, but sure, keep that to yourself. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people down here today making my day miserable because they're coming down where I work and they're shopping and making me do extra work. I don't appreciate it at all, you know. Send them home, right? Send them. I had to. I'll shut the building down or something. I don't know. I better be careful saying that, though. <laughs> What's your dream job? My dream job, I don't know. Honestly, it's it's where I'm the boss. I don't care what I have to do. It's just that I don't have to listen to anybody else, take any orders from anybody. So I don't know. Maybe I'll open up a massage parlor or something. I don't know. Massage parlor? You never know. It'd be a nice job. <laughs> my name is Venk Modur. 
Vank Motor. Great name. Thank you. I try. That's what your parents named you. That is what my parents named me. I'm Indian. You know, I'm actually unemployed, so I'm walking with my friend for her to go shopping, and I'm watch. Really? You dress pretty well for an unemployed guy. Uh, I have nice parents. <laughs> and you're shopping with your girlfriend? No, she, she, unfortunately, she would not date me. No, she's a little too tall for my short ass. Oh, can I say that on television? <laughs> so you do a little shopping and then uh, maybe a little dinner tonight? Maybe a, a more like drinks in the afternoon. That's, oh, yeah? that's probably what's going to happen. You've had a few today so far? No, actually I'm sober, surprisingly. I guess it is a little early. And no, it's never too early to drink. <laughs> love isn't blind. I think it's very visual. I think that's how you fall in love with people, by watching them naked. Would you rather have your pants pulled down in front of like 10 of your closest friends or in front of 100 people you didn't know? I would say 10 of my closest friends because they've probably already seen it. So. <laughs> I'm just that's another joke. No, I would say in front of your friends. At least they'll laugh at you to your face. You know? 